What's up Star Wars card collectors and fans? It's time for our weekly Bounty Hunter Blaster Box ordeal. I got two today, I figured, what the heck, let's double it up again. So let's crack these open. Again, looking for those parallels, looking for those auto sketches. Um, most likely will be patch cards though. Most of these blaster boxes are patch cards. But if it is a patch card, hopefully it's a numbered one. And hopefully if it's a parallel, it is one we do not have. So that is the name of the game. Let's take a look at these real quick. One of these, good chance, is thicker than the others. This one, are these potentially thicker? I can't really tell. Probably one of those though, so we'll leave that down at the bottom and then let's rip open this one. We'll have all of them out at the same time. There's so many of these boxes. Worst thing in the world. Okay, this one definitely looks thicker. Uh, yeah, so we'll go like this. Okay, and I got my parallel list here in front of me, so let's open that. Keep that handy dandy near us. We're looking for. Base one through three, green, purple, and red parallels. Um, there is the crazy offset chance we'd get a super fractor, but not banking on it. Okay. Yeah, most of the stuff is going towards a, a large second or third deck at this point. We've got a Chewbacca green. Let's take a look at this. We've got to sleeve this up too. Probably have a better, nicer sleeve than that. Let's see, put that in. This is BI 76 or base 176. 109 out of 150. 76 is one I have though. So this is this is going into the duplicate number pile, which I have a ton of. I have a lot of the ones I'm missing, but a lot of duplicate ones, rather. Uh, which I guess I could use for trading. I, I could sell them as individual singles, but uh, some of them I even have three of, which is crazy. Uh, not trying to hoard them all, I promise. But when I get what I'm looking for, then I'll consolidate and slim down just doesn't seem to make sense right now. Okay, nothing out of those. I'm gonna go through these pretty quick. So. Oh, there's our base two blue parallel. Don't have as many of those. Or possibly get a nice second set of that to put that up on eBay when I come across that. Really looking for these base three blue parallels. That's what I'm missing a bunch of. They're not numbered, but they only one out of 10 packs in those. Cad Banes are one out of 12, Horse Sings one out of eight. Oh, speak of the devil. There's base three blue parallel. So the odds of you getting one in a blaster is like one, you know, one out of the whole box, so. We got another base one green parallel. Let's get a let's get a good sleeve for that. This is number B so base one B133 and we don't have it. Which is interesting. I have a lot of base one green parallels, so this is number 76 out of 150. So, welcome to the club. All right. 
one less single to hunt down on eBay, you know. There usually are plenty of singles available, so one might say, well, why are you going through boxes for them? But um, it's fun to rip the packs. There's always a chance you get something pretty crazy. Um, and I do buy singles. I, I do buy a lot of singles. But I also like opening, too. So if it's like a little balancing act, like open some, buy a few singles, open some, buy a few singles, you'll eventually get to where you need to be. Um, Particularly if I'm close to finishing a set of something, then you know maybe it's worth getting singles. But I'm not going to get singles for the duplicate, uh, like base one through three, uh, non-paralleled. Um, right. We know that's a, a patch, so kind of going back and forth between one blaster box to the other. We'll save those patches for the end. I only pulled a sketch once and it was pretty cool. I got it graded. I ended up trading it for, I know somebody who watches on the channel, uh, got a custom slab on it, looked really sick. You can see what it looked like in one of my previous graded card reveals. It's pretty cool looking. I actually was hesitant to get rid of it, but I always need more sealed product for the channel, so I figured it was time to let it go out into the ether, let other people enjoy it. Um, which, ooh, here we go. There's base three blue parallel. That's good. Getting a lot of base two here. You know, I would have thought, because base one you're going to get in every pack. There's just, like, no way around it. Um, but base two seems quite common. And these feared mercenary cards, you're going to get them in every pack. There's nothing you can do about it. I really, that was, like, the one thing I think that detracts from this set big time. Like, other than people weren't too thrilled about the general card designs themselves. Creep car, good job. Uh, oh, ooh, Jingle Fet Red. And a Cad Bane card. All right, let's shove this Cad Bane in. We'll put this aside, because these are, you know, good cards. This is uh, base one three, number 46 out of 75. And I do have it, interestingly enough. It's like one of the few early ones I have. Well, <sighs> Guess we're going to another duplicate pile here. Well, that's part of the hard part when you get closer and closer to completing, right? Less and less odds of getting them. Okay, now for our pretty much patch cards. We know we're gonna get out of here. I'm not saving the packs, so we don't need to make them look all pretty. Yeah, it's definitely a patch. Feared Mercs, base one, base three. Oh, and that's a Bosk. Oh, that like literally couldn't be more boring. I have literally four of these exact ones. So that's a huge womp, womp, womp. Nothing exciting there. Hopefully this one's better. Please tell me this one's better. Don't be a boss. Unnumbered. It's just so boring. Base one, base three, and it's a Greedo. So it's unnumbered as well. So we got this Greedo and Bosk patch card. Wow. Not exciting patch cards at all. Um, we did get three numbered cards, uh, but I have two of them, so... Definitely not the craziest box. Hopefully I don't have one of these. Thanks for checking these out. If you like watching some of this content, I have lots of Bounty Hunter Blaster openings, as well as tops of Star Wars CCG, among other things along the way. So check those out too.